welcome to devices help and support. Your ultimate destination for all things related to devices setup, troubleshooting, and optimizing your tech experience. In this video, we'll guide you through the simple process of setting up any Wadlink Outdoor Long Range Wi-Fi Extender. Whether you're trying to extend your Wi-Fi range to cover your backyard, garden, or other outdoor spaces, this tutorial will help you achieve strong, reliable connectivity in just a few easy steps. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more tech tutorials. First, begin by plugging in your Wavlink Outdoor Wi-Fi extender into a power outlet, ensuring it's securely connected. Once it's plugged in, press the power button to turn on the device. You'll notice the LED indicators on the extender lighting up, signaling that it is powered on successfully. It may take a few moments for the extender to fully boot up, during which the LED lights might blink. Wait until the power light remains steady, indicating that the extender is ready for setup. You can use either of the devices such as your mobile phone or your laptop. Click on the Wi-Fi icon located in the taskbar at the bottom right corner of your screen. This will bring up a list of all available wireless networks in your area. The list will display both your primary Wi-Fi network and any nearby connections, including the Wavlink Extender's default network. If prompted, enter the appropriate password or proceed without one if none is required. In the address bar at the top of the browser window, type www.wavelink.com or directly enter the extender's default IP address, 192.168.10.1, then press Enter. This will take you to the Wavlink Extender's login page. If the page doesn't load right away, double-check that you're still connected to the Extender's Wi-Fi network and that the IP address is entered correctly. On the login page, enter the default username and password, usually both set to admin click login to access the Extender's configuration settings. Once logged in, you'll be directed to the setup interface. Select the appropriate mode, e.g., repeater mode, and follow the on-screen instructions to scan for and connect to your existing Wi-Fi network. After entering your Wi-Fi password, save the settings to complete the configuration. If Share and subscribe to Devices Help and Support for more tech tutorials. See you in the next video.